everyone. So this is going to be a message for someone and I feel it might be claimed, okay? Um, I mentioned it in the October predictions. If you've not seen that, check that video out because it's going to help us move through quite a bit of... Um, I mean, the US had this alarm alert. The UK, we, we had it. Um, some of us might switch the... I don't know. I had I, I had voiced how you can not get this to, but at that time I didn't. It was one of my first videos, and um, I, you know, a lot of you probably didn't see it. So, and I was telling all my family. This cocker spaniel comes just comes through to me, and. Um, you're going to have to let me know in the comments because I'll add on a comment, obviously. He, I want to say it's a he, it's a dog, it's not a female. And he is, so um, the colour is very clear to me. If the colour is this, um, this is yours. There's a person who had commented. Um, he's... The sable word comes through, but he's not sable. The true meaning of sable is where it goes um, like a light braid in, into a brown and a dark, uh, a, a black, like a German shepherd. He's actually white and like a chestnut brown or a brown. He might have a sable spot for the word sable coming through. Um, sometimes with Cocker Spaniels, um, they can be a dominant in one colour as opposed to another. So when I say that, I don't mean that he's dominant in the chestnut brown um, more than the white. Like he hasn't got mainly chestnut brown and then little white patches. If anything, it's more opposite. The white is quite potent. I want to say his age is around... one three months to about five or six and the word that comes through is brent with it brent b-r-e-n-t and when i was asking i was like this is a weird name and then i was i think i was trying to get a name but i wasn't actually sitting and meditating if i sit and meditate for a little bit on this then i can do but I felt like my energy is just going all over and I've actually not felt very well about um, how much I'm putting into certain energies. So, and that's not around uh, client readings, but in terms of things like, for example, where Spirit said not for me not to read on Summer Wells, uh, he didn't give me the yes yet. Um, I was very much into it. And that, again, in most of my readings said there's going to be justice on that case. So that's good, and I might do a reading on it, because I know that there's a lot of things going, there's different stories going on about it. Anyway, back to the beautiful Cocker Spaniel. So he come through and I was thinking, whose is this Cocker Spaniel? And I was trying to think if Spirit had sent it, you know, give it, giving me a sign, because it was kind of a challenging day, but then, you know, he persisted for the past 10 days. Um, he's around, like I said, 1.3 1 1 months to 6. So he is not, he didn't pass away old. And he sometimes comes through to me like, I can see him formed as a dog, but he's still quite lively, energetic, like a puppy. And I want to say the tail is not chopped. Those of you that have cocker spaniels or dogs that where the tail is, I want to say the tail is not chopped. Um, like I said, he's quite he's he's white, very lively, very jumpy. When he comes around me, he's very jumpy, very energetic. Do you know when dogs are like jumping because they're like either come get my lead or um, you know they're trying to get your attention or. Um, they just want to play where they zoom back and forth. He's just very jumpy and bouncy. And um, 
sometimes when I tap into him, he comes to me a bit plumper and fluffier and a smaller version of himself. Although he is already not an old dog in his years, sometimes he just suddenly, as he's jumping in, in the years I see him, the ones that I mentioned, um, and like I said, it could even be from two to six. He's not more than six. He, I'd say he's around maybe going on to five, but I'm going to give it that thing because he's presenting himself to me. He's a, he's a, you know, when dogs start going out of being a puppy, but they've already kind of grown into a dog body, he's kind of presenting himself that way. Um, and I think it's about his energy that is, he's doing that. Um, and just adorable, fun loving, and really persistent in my energy. It has calmed down a bit, and that's why I think, um, although obviously it's, it's still present for me to remember, I did promise that I'd do a little message. So if this is for you, let me know in the comments if it describes it. Brent doesn't have to be his name. It can be a road name. It can be, you know, something, a word Brent can be related. And I've not meditated, so the word, it could, he could also have a bit of a, not like a, um, for example, what is a traditional dog name? I don't know. You know, I don't know. You know, just like the normal, you know, the names that you, the most common names, he might not have that most common name, but Brent is potent. Whether it's, you know, someone's in the family's middle name, whether it's a street name, whether it related to something, it's, even if this doesn't, word doesn't click, it will click later. So that's the Cocker Spaniel that's coming through. Uh, let me know in the comments if it meets this is going to meet exactly the, the, the description. Okay, it's going to meet exactly the description. I tap into energy, so he's not alive. He's, he's not alive, he's passed over, um, and it wasn't from old age. So if the colour, if the, around the age, if, if, most of, if what I've said, 99.9% .9 or 100% meets it, let me know in the comments, um, and I'll add a little bit more context. So I hope everyone has a lovely day and I'm going to see you in our next reading, Beautiful Souls. Bye for now.